Doors opened at PSA Organica about two weeks ago. Before that, the medical cannabis dispensary operated without a permit. Then, new ownership of the dispensary took over. License takes a lot of money, takes a lot of work, and takes a lot of effort. This is the fifth licensed dispensary in Palm Springs. Employees with PSA Organica claim their company focuses on a specific type of patient. There's definitely a clientele of younger kids who smoke pot that doesn't tend to be our clientele. It's not who we cater to. We don't even bring the products in here that they're really looking for. We've sat down on many occasions and had that discussion. Do we bring in the more popular concentrates that they want? We voted no to that. That means focusing on products that don't necessarily get patients high. It already has a loyal following of patients who say they won't get their cannabis from anywhere else. It's not really a dispensary attitude. It's more of, it's like friends, family. Everybody knows everybody, even, even the clients who walk in know all the names and everything, and we know everybody here. These people work with you from, from everything from edibles to ointments to uh, vapors or anything else, but you know consistently what you're getting. It's so beautiful, and they're so nice and friendly, and they have a really good choice of edibles. PSA Organica also offers discounts to military veterans. The VA, for one, will not provide uh, our medical cannabis. So coming to a shop or medical shop like this helps, um, especially with the discounts that we get. Um, and there are people that care. Even after the grand opening, things are going to continue to grow here at PSA Organica. This large portion of the building they plan on using as a wellness center where they'll have acupuncture or even yoga classes or places where people can get educated on medical marijuana. But all that all still needs to be approved by Palm Springs City Council. For the cannabis patient with a green thumb, they have an indoor garden where patients can pick up a plant to grow their own cannabis at home. The garden is just for hobbyists that might want to come in. We have patients donate plants that they try to grow, and then we have patients that buy them that try to grow them out. And it's just their own enthusiasm over a plant, you know, and seeing how they can grow one plant as long as they have a card. Palm Springs City Council has approved a sixth medical cannabis dispensary in the city. That one is scheduled to open sometime in March. Joe Galley, News Channel 3, Palm Springs.